The Philippine president is visiting the devastated city of Tacloban. Benigno Aquino is being criticized for his response to Typhoon Haiyan. People are angry it's taking so long for aid to reach cutoff areas and also that estimates of the number of dead are so uncertain. Officially, almost 4,000 people are now confirmed dead. Millions are homeless. Earlier this morning, we heard from a Canadian doctor who's helping out with relief efforts. Christine Wang is a delegate to the International Red Cross. She's in Manila, coordinating the organization's response to the disaster. Needs here are great. Uh, there are people with uh, difficulty accessing water, food, shelter. Uh, those are the main concerns. We also have a lot of health needs. Uh, there was quite a bit of trauma. 50%, uh, over 50% of the health facilities that we have been able to access to uh, to see the damages have been uh, affected. There are a couple areas that we still have very spotty information about, uh, mainly in Palawan in the west and also on the island of Rambla in the middle of Philippines. We know that these two islands are, were uh, in the path of the typhoon, so we expect there to be devastation there. We have to try our best. Uh, the biggest issue, of course, when you have such a large disaster is you have a lot of difficulty getting to an area. The roads, uh, all the means of transport uh, are affected, so uh, it becomes uh, quite difficult to get the aid to the communities. That's Christine Wang. She's a Canadian doctor working with the International Red Cross in the Philippines.